Hey, Dr. Will Lee here. I am back at the Village Market in the Mediterranean, and I just finished creating a bunch of content uh, for my uh, next course, which is going to start on August 7th. Uh, it's Eat to Beat Disease course. You're going to hear me talk about some of the goodies that I actually found here. Let me just give you a little sneak peek at some of the really cool things I'm going to show you. Um, I found some strawberries, uh, which have uh, really amazing amounts of elagic acid. you got to check this out. There's a beautiful display here. Elagic acid helps your health defense systems and actually helps your metabolism as well. Here it is. Check it out. Just want to stop down look at these. Look at these beautiful, that beautiful color, red color. Um, and so I talk about that. Um, just made a video for it. Sorry, I've got to navigate my way through the crowd. Look at this crowd. All right, this is actually what you get when you're shopping at the market for fresh food. Um, something else I talked about are tomatoes. Of course, one of my favorite subjects. Tomatoes. And I also talked about uh, legumes. Now, usually you think about like white beans, canned beans. Check it out. This is cocoa rouge. Red cocoa beans, right? Uh, and here's uh, Ericode, green beans. And these are white beans over here. Just some of the examples of the foods that I found in the Mediterranean market. I just recorded some new content for my Eat to Beat Disease course. My next course is actually going to begin on August 7th, coming right up. It's going to be my last one uh, for the summer. So I hope that if you guys are ready to actually make a change in your life uh, to uh, uh, start eating uh, to beat disease, but also eating to increase the quality of your life for healthy aging, uh, this is the course that uh, you take on your own time, uh, uh, but I do show up live and we go over some of my new research I've discovered uh, on my, re uh, my trips to the Mediterranean. You're going to hear a lot about the new bioactives we actually discovered in uh, foods like melons, eggplant, uh, and uh, uh, onions. Uh, really, really cool uh, stuff. Now let me just show you another display. Olives, some of my favorite things. Hydroxy tyrosol present in the meat of olives. And then if you go over here, you'll see some of the um, purees uh, that they actually do with uh, olives. Let's see if I can find one over here. Look at this green olive puree. Um, yeah, sun dried tomatoes, lycopene, rich in lycopene. Uh, this market is a uh, just really kind of like a, a candy store uh, for health, uh, and um, I'm about to share some of the stuff. I'm going to put it onto my course uh, just shortly. Uh, my team is ready to get it um, edited, so if you haven't taken my Eat to Beat Disease course, uh, sign up. Links in my bio. And it's going to be a great one. I'm going to really enjoy uh, sharing the most recent research from my trip to the Mediterranean, what I'm finding in the market that you can actually find in your grocery store. So this is really me sharing my experiences as a scientist, as a doctor, as a food as a medicine researcher. But my point is that you can actually find many of these healthy ingredients and foods in your regular grocery store. I'm going to share those with you. Uh, so sign up for my Eat to Beat Disease course. Starts on August 7th. Links in the bio. Uh, and uh, hope to see you there. Dr. Lee, out.